also another potential side effect that's been a discussion amongst tens of thousands of people who reported seeing a change in their menstrual cycle after receiving the vaccines uh, from lighter to heavier than usual bleeding uh, to spotting and even missed periods. A lot of people have been getting in touch with me to tell me that they've had the experience of having a slightly different period after they received the COVID vaccine. Experts like Vicky Mail, who is based out of the United Kingdom, are looking to gather more data on these reports to see if there is a link between COVID vaccines and periods. Enough people are reporting it anecdotally that I think it's something that it's time we did some formal research into. The Society of Obstetricians and Gynecologists of Canada says... There is no known association between any of the COVID-19 vaccines and menstrual changes. Any individual menstrual changes can be triggered by many life events, including weight changes or stress, as well as the changes that occur as a part of a woman's life. We asked Toronto Public Health, Health Canada and the Ontario government how many reports each received for reported side effects connected to menstrual cycles. No responses were provided in time for broadcast. Like Canada, the UK also has been collecting data on the side effects caused by vaccines. Mail states that nearly 14,000 people have reported seeing a change in their periods after having one of the three COVID shots approved. What people most commonly report is a heavier period. And the next most common thing to report is a lighter period. And then various other things also get reported. But the problem is we don't know yet if these are real side effects of the vaccine. The reason being, according to the reproductive immunologist, is there's no good data to compare what normal periods look like. There are also other factors that can impact cycles, with Mail also highlighting that a quarter of people with COVID-19 saw a change in their menstrual cycle. She also notes that other vaccines, including flu shots, have also been known to impact periods. There's also data from the HPV vaccine. They found that it was more likely that you'd have heavy or irregular periods shortly after you'd been having the vaccine. It's been one week since Mail launched her study. So far, 150 participants have been identified. And if we knew that this was a common side effect that would last for only one month, which does seem to be what people are reporting, then we could simply say to people, hey, by the way, we know that, I don't know, let's perhaps say 5% of people will have a heavier period than normal after the vaccine. This isn't something that you should worry about. So this discussion also happening online and Vicky Mail, along with a number of other experts are also reinforcing uh, or addressing some misinformation. They're reinforcing uh, that the approved vaccines will not affect fertility. Now, if you do see a change in your period after receiving the vaccine, Mail says it is important to report it uh, to your local public health officials. Uh, but she says more importantly, don't worry. These are short terms and they will not affect you for the rest of your life.